Hi, my name is Tom Carpenter, and I'd like to welcome you to our CompTIA Cloud Plus course. Now, I've been working with cloud technologies now for nearly 10 years as an IT professional, an IT person using and abusing those technologies. And I'm going to be able to share with you my experiences as we go throughout this course. What I've learned sometimes the hard way and sometimes the easy way. I've helped thousands of people to prepare for their AWS Solutions Architect Associate Certification exam. In addition to that, I've helped many more thousands of people prepare for dozens of other certifications over the years. Now, in this course, we're going to be focusing on the objectives for the Cloud Plus certification. That's exam CV0-002. And what we're going to be doing is covering everything from the introduction of the cloud all the way through to the components, the parts and pieces that make up these cloud technologies. Now, here's my commitment to you. I'm not going to go through the next several hours with you just reading slides to you, but rather I'm going to teach you from my experience how these cloud technologies work. So you're going to gain a real world understanding for what's going on in the cloud. Okay, so what's in this course? Well, we have several chapters of quality information that's going to help you master the foundational knowledge of cloud technologies. First of all, we're going to start with a good understanding for what Cloud Plus is all about and certification preparation tips and so forth. Then we'll move on to chapter one, introducing the cloud, where we'll get a good overview for what cloud technologies are all about and what's available to us in our use of the cloud. Then we'll move on to system requirements for cloud deployments. This is a key thing. I'm a huge believer in understanding requirements before we implement anything. So we're going to go over that very important topic. Then we'll talk about the individual components of the cloud chapter by chapter. We'll talk about cloud storage, cloud compute, cloud networking, and cloud security. So these are very important components, four of the key components in implementing any kind of cloud solution. Then we'll talk about migrating to the cloud. Sometimes you've already got systems. You're not deploying new technologies and you need to move them into the cloud. So we'll see how that's accomplished. Additionally, we'll talk about maintaining cloud solutions. How do I keep my systems up to date? How do I make sure that everything's operating on current code and proper, stable, and secure code? And then finally, we'll deal with troubleshooting. Because once we have all of this knowledge, we're prepared to be able to troubleshoot. And that's a key thing. And I do want to add that as we go throughout all of these chapters, we're not just talking about the cloud you might think of. You might think of Azure. You might think of AWS or Google Cloud Platform. But we're also talking about the cloud you might not think of. It's called the private cloud. So Cloud Plus covers both of these, and we're going to address them throughout the course. Now, we also have some bonus materials for you. You're going to get a PDF of the exam objectives easily available, so no hassles of going through the process of getting your hands on that document. It tells you everything you need to know from a knowledge domain perspective for the Cloud Plus exam. We also have slide handouts for you to help you study, so that way you'll have nice notes that you can use to cover on exam day or as you go throughout the learning process. Additionally, at the end of every chapter, we have quiz questions to test your knowledge, to make sure that you've comprehended the information covered in that particular chapter. With all of this that we're providing to you, you'll be well prepared on exam day.